Welcome back to RealVacantLand.com. This is Luke Smith. I've got another property for you. This one is uh, over my shoulder here. It's between it's between this, this mobile home and the house over there. There's utilities along the street. There's a paved street. Let's jump into it. I'm asking $399 for this property. It's been on the website for a while, but the map wasn't really working, so nobody really knew where it was. So I just updated that. And I lowered the price. Now it's $399 with no checkout fees. So it's just full, plain $399. I'll pay the taxes on it. I was just looking up the taxes, you know, seeing what's going on. And I, I owe like, you know, last year, I owe like two years of taxes. And the taxes have been like 23 this year and 31 the year before. And the, 30, the difference is probably because I got a late fee in there. Or something. So I'm going to pay the taxes on this. You don't even have to worry about the taxes. You just do the 399 bucks for a piece of property with a paved road. You can see the road here in the maps and uh, houses on either side and utilities, utilities to go to the property. So utilities like sewer, water, electric, um, those things all cost more than $399 <laughs> if you go get, them, go get them brought into property wherever you're talking about. So you get this land for $399 with all the utilities ready to go. You could put a mobile home on here. Uh, you could build a house on it. You could just give it to your grandkids or whatever you want to do with a piece of land. This is just sitting there. Nobody's using it. And um, somebody, I'm sure, has an idea of how they want to use this property. Hopefully that's you watching this video and you're like, $399 for a piece of land. Luke, you're crazy. <laughs> yeah, that's the idea. So here's the land. Uh, it's, it's, uh, it's in a little town. Let's see what town this is. I don't even know what town this is. Let's do the map. Uh, El Dorado. Okay, so this is El Dorado. And before COVID, there was an airline that flew in here. I mean, you could get flights from, I think it was uh, um, Dallas. I think it was over here, you know, Dallas. You could fly into El Dorado. So you could get flights in and out of, of El Dorado. So it's a bigger size town. Um, I've, I've helped people like get bus tickets and stuff to go to their properties and things in El Dorado. I've sold properties around this area numerous times in the past. So El Dorado has, has transportation. It's got supplies. It's got stores. You know, there's a Walmart here in the north part of town. So we keep zooming in. You'll see that this is, this is on the outskirts of town. And um, oh, here's the airport. Here's the airport's on the south side of town. It's a nice little town. Um, so let's jump out of that. This is El Dorado, Arkansas, Southern Arkansas, pretty mild weather and elevations, 264 feet. I got GPS coordinates on here. So if you're trying to go check out the property, please don't ask me for the mailing address because it's vacant land. I don't know what the address is. We've got a GPS coordinates over here. You can click on that and that'll give you like where the property actually is. So if you click on it in your phone, it'll give you driving directions. It'll drive you over to the property. It'll probably say X, Y, Z, whatever street number. But that's when we're trading land, it's, it's the legal description. We got the legal description on here. It's the subdivision number nine, two, whatever the numbers are. So all those numbers, that's the describer of the property. That's what we're actually selling. It's not a mailing address. People keep asking me for the addresses of these properties because that's how you go, you know, usually how you find a house, right? Land doesn't work that well. So it's saying taxes, $23 a year. I think this is the last year's taxes. You know, future taxes will probably be something different, but that gives you an idea of what the taxes are to hold on to a property like this. Um, there's directions to Walmart, north part of town. It's saying uh, nine minutes away. Here's the local school and the, po the post office and uh, medical center and gas station. And yeah, so there's all kinds of supplies around here. I put that kind of stuff on the, the listings to tell you how far out in the middle of nowhere or close to town these properties are that I keep, keep putting. We've got different pictures on the website. My name and numbers up here if you want to call me and haggle me about this property. I, I've never been there. <laughs> Just like pretty much everything I know about these properties I put in these videos. Um, so you got to go check it out. Go check it out and see if this is the right property for you. 399 bucks. If you've never been to ruralvacantland.com, we've got the buy it now button. And uh, you can get to this website by clicking the link. It's in the description of this video. Or if you're watching on your TV, you can go on your phone and search ruralvacantland.com and go find this property. And at 399 bucks, this is in Union County, Arkansas. Buy it now button. Hit the buy it now button. 
And uh, then it'll start asking you questions. It'll ask you what name do you want to own this property in? You know, what, and eventually it'll ask you how do you want to pay for it? Your credit card, debit card, banking account information to like use ACH, you know, like the numbers you have at the bottom of a checkbook, right? If you want to pay that way, there's a couple different ways you can pay for it. And then I'll do the paperwork and I'll get it recorded and uh, we'll send you the deed and it's in your name. And then you can confirm it with the county and everything. It's got the little stamps and tax numbers and everything on the paperwork. And there's your, pro it's your property. So... <laughs> It's, uh, it's that simple. It's just like buying stuff on Amazon. You can buy land on ruralvacantland.com. $399 for this one. It's the land in between that house and this trailer right in here. Um, thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. If you like to see videos like this, hit the subscribe button. I'll keep them coming over time. We've got hundreds of properties to show off and uh, get somebody to go use, right? So I'll keep making videos, try to get these properties into, into production. Talk to you later. Bye.